In this episode, we continue the planning of our new city and we start construction. Stay tuned. Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. In uh, the last episode, we uh, laid out this uh, some of these components over here. And in between episodes, I've started laying out another kind of residential component. And I thought what I was going to do was I'm going to lay out a lot more of these residential clusters and then come back for the new episode so we actually start doing something. And I thought um, my thought process for some of these things might be of some interest to you. And so I thought maybe I should not do that so that I can explain how I do these super blocks a little bit more. So the intent really is for us to do these super blocks with limited access off of these main roads, which is very similar to what you would do um, in a real life city planning context. You would uh, get your primary distributor and only have minor accesses off them so that the vehicles continue to flow. Um, and that's kind of what we're what we're doing over here. So I will go ahead and get that moved on. So here I've, I've had another strip of residential buildings and they're all off of a little cul-de-sac road over here. Also put a secret police station here. These will have access to the train station over here, but they will also have access to the shopping center. What is this that we have here? This is an orphanage. That's probably okay. There's a school over here, which would probably supplement that, but I'm thinking we need something like another school and, and a few other facilities over here. So let's grab some other facilities that we could could use. So another orphanage maybe, but really let's get a get an extra school in place. And let's do a big school. So let's do a big school next to the rail. Um, something like this over here. So there's another reason for us to bring a road in all the way up here. Like so. And then I wanted to have a quick look at the sports playgrounds facilities. I think I I've, I've kind of enjoy laying it out. If, we, if, it's, if there's not a lot happening in the game, I, I do apologize. Um, we sometimes will lay out stuff. Sometimes we do a little bit less. Sometimes we, uh, we have the game, the guys building stuff. Um, but that's just kind of all par for the course, really. Um, so sports facilities. Ah. So if we go a big sports hall, that doesn't actually even get a... It doesn't actually even get us uh, get a, a, a road uh, a road access point. I don't want to get it too close to the rail, just in case at some point we want to make some changes here. If we've got it on top of it, it's probably a bit of a problem. Can we? The question is, can we do a few of these? I, I do like um, adding a couple of spots like this um, in some of these in some of these areas. Just make a make a bit better use of of the areas in between here. So let's do like maybe a little. A little something like that, noting full well that, this, uh, that during snowy times, that's probably going to be a, a bit of a challenge. Now, what else? We've got an indoor pool, and that's got a, a bit of a, a road connection. So let's do an indoor pool, um, and let's see about squeezing it in a little something like that, maybe. That'll be pretty close to the rail, but not quite on top of it. So let's do something like that. Now, with these road connection sections over here, we can do something like that. Okay, that's one thing, but we need a few other bits and pieces. So certainly one of the key things we need is a kindergarten. So let's get a few uh, medium kinder. Well, let's at least just get one kindergarten over here. I'm going to have a little walkway all the way down the back there. So that's um, that's the plan. So we'll leave a little bit of room for that. We'll get this kindergarten to go in here. It seems like we will definitely need another. So something like that should be okay. We definitely need another power distribution facility somewhere like so. We'll put, pop it next to the kindergarten and that should power a few other things. Uh, actually, we can spin it around because we'll have a little pathway on the other side. Okay, so we'll place that in there. That should power a few things over here. I'm hoping it'll it'll work. It'll be sufficient. Got a few, but they're not actually quite reaching all of it. But that should help us out a little bit. What other facilities do we need? We could do some tourist facilities. Certainly, certainly is something that's that's useful. We could do a zoo potentially somewhere up here. That's something we could do. Um, okay, let's just go back to what is the the residential facilities that we need. So we need. 
Uh, we've got a store there. We could probably do with another store slash restaurant thing. It's the big one. That's the big one. Is there a smaller... Um, let's, let's grab a smaller shop. A smaller shop. Some of these shops are pretty big. But I do want us to have a shop that does everything like this one. Okay, that's just a commercial building. Is there something a little smaller? It could kind of work nicely. I don't, I'm not a big fan of these guys, though. Ah, uh, why not, actually? Why not? That could, could still work. Let's uh, do one of those. And then here's a corner department store. It's a standard commercial building. Yeah, let's do another one of those. So there's a couple of extra options that we now have. So if we pop in here... Let's grab that guy. Yeah, that's pretty good. We, it would probably be a good idea for us to just kind of have that to the back. Uh, may, yeah, maybe, maybe in here somewhere. Could even do a little bit of a square type arrangement. So if we do that, we definitely need a bit of a storage for it also. If we go storage over here, that's the storage. Hmm. I don't mind that too much, actually. Let's do something like that. That's pretty tight over there. Now we just need a bit of a road connection there. What else do we need in here? Something culture related? Uh, yeah, none of this. No universities, culture, culture. It's in here, I would imagine. Ah, here we go. Culture related. So like a, a main library maybe? Yeah, I think that's good. Or even, there was a new cinema, right? Let's get one of those new cinemas. Oh, there was a new cinema in the modded stuff that I got. A new cinema, that one there. Oh, no, that's a Philharmonic. Where is the new cinema that I had? Where is it? Somehow I don't think it's made its way in. Right? Something's funny. Anyway, with it not being there, let's just go with whatever we there is that we've got here. So, what is that? That's a library. That's a cinema. Let's, let's go and grab a cinema at least. Was it a cinema? I can't remember. So what I'm trying to do is getting a little bit of a area going on over here. Noting full well that we need a few roads to pop in here too. So there we go. We'll put a cinema over there. Anything else that we can, can squeeze in? Maybe, um, yeah, let's get a, get a main library. Oh, actually, that's pretty good. Right there. It kind of squares out this area a little bit. Can we um, flip it around? Yeah, that's the one. Flip it around, do it this way. Now, that's awesome. Okay, so with these things in here, that's going to give us a fair bit more to go on. So now, let's just get where this road is going to go. What I'll do... I'll do the road a little bit like this, and then like so. We do uh, something like that. And I'll trim this back a little bit up to here. We'll get that to start a bit of a straight line. There we go. There we go. So that should work. Then I'm going to get a bit of a road connection in over here. And on this side... We'll get that road connection over there. Ah, oh, you know what we're missing is a gas station. So let's uh, let's go ahead and commission that. That gives us a little bit of extra room. We could actually use this as a bit of a park and some paths and things like that. That would be really good. Oh, and there was a question around um, the size of these super blocks approximately. So if we measure from there to there, 
that is about four, 490. So it's about 500 meters. I think that's kind of what I, that, I, I didn't plan it. I didn't plan it, but I think that makes for a nice, um, nice area. Let's delete all of those measurements and we start measuring again. And this one will be a little bit smaller, I think. Uh, yeah, uh, under 400. Let's do that. And then on this side, it's probably going to be a fair bit bigger. So almost 600. But anyway, it's about 500, 600 meters. So it's all pretty good. It's all pretty good in terms of, uh, in terms of walkability, really, for these distances. So that's all good. That's a, another bit of a use of that super block over there. Um, and I think we'll continue to do some of that things. But what I thought would be interesting is if we actually leave the rail as no residential components on the other side of the rail. So we, so that what we can do is we can have some industrial usages along here, along the ridge of the mountain here. So certainly getting my heating in this play, in, in this area would be awesome. Now let's quickly do a few of our key walkways. So I definitely want to run one long proper walkway up here. That's good and we'll see about tying in a lot of these things but I would like to run it all the way through here and then probably need like bridges across here just to make sure it looks okay. Let's commission that just to indicate that we're gonna do a nice long straight walkway down there to the back of the building, probably one on the other side too, to be honest. Okay, good. Now let's get our um, heating infrastructure. Oh, let's just get a gas station first. So let's get a few gas stations in place. I am after, ooh, we are also looking for a bit of a car dealer. This is a car dealer. And we're looking for parking also. Okay, so a car dealer. Let's see about getting a car dealer in place. We could. We could squeeze a little something in here. Yeah, I'll do that. We'll get a car dealer in there. Actually, not too bad. It's going to cause a little bit of an issue there. So that's a car dealer, but we need um, gas, sta uh, gas stations. Okay, let's um, let's find in our mod list what kind of gas stations it is that we want. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Where is it? Petrol, petrol, gas. Is it gas? It's gas stations, right? That's what they're called. E -F -G. Yeah, it's gas stations. Okay, we've got some super nice ones. I like something like this that's maybe not the one-way variety. Station loading, unloading, four. Yeah, so let's get one of those in there. Let's get the one-way variety in there too. And then I'm kind of looking at maybe getting one of these, get it the XXL in there and get one of the like medium ones in there and we'll get a bit of a, an extra small component in there too. So there's a few, as a bit of a variety in terms of gas stations for us. So what does the XXL look like? That's huge. I'm not going to have that in the city. If we go with one of these guys, yeah, that pretty, pretty reasonable. And what does the kind of extra small look like? That's, that's pretty good, right? If we have a few more of them, just, just all around, it's not going to be too bad. So something like that, I am... Not opposed to a little bit of a station like that. So we'll put a, a gas station in there. So we'll get a few of these little smaller gas stations throughout our throughout our area. So that's something maybe we we need something slightly larger in this area. Let's get maybe one of these um what does the M2 look like? Yeah, that's not bad, but we could also do with uh maybe this one. Just off, and that one could just be off of that road there. Okay, so people can go ahead and get their gas over there. So there's a gas station spot. And then I was wondering about one of these big ones at least. So the XXL one. Let's zoom it out. And that's a bit of a one-way operation, right? Yeah, I think that I think that would be cool to have one of these these ones in here. And what we'll do is we'll kind of have it just 
like so. Okay, we'll place that over there, and then I'm gonna grab the um, the roads. And what we'll do is we'll put one the road in this way, and one the road in that way, and form part of what we're gonna do with the roads on this side too. So we'll run one of these roads in there. We'll probably need to bring something off of there as well. Actually, maybe let's not do it off of that side. Let's get it it's something to go off of here. Well. I'm kind of wondering how It's uh let's continue to straighten that up a little bit. You know what? We could Give it a little bit of a meander like this. And then, and this is a little bit more sensible. We tie that one in there. Tie that in like so. Do a little something like this. Get these connected over here. There's a bit of a one-way setup there. And we could even do a little something like so that we would there we go so that's the kind of the use of the super block so the idea is not really for a lot of through traffic in this area but that kind of helps us out i'm going to go ahead and and um, commission that and then we can probably lay out a few things oh we need a an extra road connection up here Go ahead and commission that one also. None of this stuff will get built by the, by itself, by the way. Okay, here we will need to probably do um, a bit of a road connection like this. Turn it in there and actually, actually that we might want it a little tighter than that. So if we do this one, go back. Yeah, so if we do this, it means that we'll have a little bit more room to do stuff on here. Let's go ahead and commission that piece. Then from here, basically, well, we'll, we'll get that one tied in on that side. Move it away a little bit more. Yeah, that's good. Do something like this. That's good. What we'll do is we'll tie that one in there. There we go. So that's pretty cool. Another use of that internal block there. It just means that the bulk of traffic will stick on the main roads and not try and drive through our little, our little neighborhood areas. Okay, so we've got a massive guy over there, a massive uh, residential building over here, which will need tons of facilities. So let's quickly do that. And then I think we're going to go and look at what our heating and, and other, other bits and pieces look like. So uh, let's get a school in place. Probably the biggest school we can get. 420 is not bad, but probably the big one. Yep, I like that. Again, we don't, don't have power over here. So that's this one. Then we definitely need a few of these kindergartens. So let's get... One kindergarten over there. Probably need to get... Another one somewhere over here about. So now we've got two kindergartens in this area. We've got a shopping center right next to it. Uh, so we can probably get people from here to attend this shopping center. What we don't have right next to it is, is that as, as a hospital. This is the closest hospital, I think. It's not bad. People should be able to walk it, but maybe 
Will they be able to walk it? Can? Uh, well, it's not connected, and this one needs to be connected over here so that they can at least walk straight down there. Let's have a quick look at a measure, see if, if that does, in fact, do the trick. So if we're going to measure from here to, say, there, that's 300. Mm -hmm. It may not. It may not be close enough. It may not be close enough. So shall we do something else? Shall we do an extra one? Well, we could do with an orphanage. Right there, again, we don't have any power here. So what I'll do is let's get a bit of a power connection going on. Again, with this guy. Right there for power. Any other facilities that we're going to need here? Well, it was the hospital piece, right? I was thinking the hospital. But let's do a, just a big clinic, maybe. Yeah, let's just do a big clinic in this area. Okay, so a big clinic over there. And then what, what about a... What about some sports playgrounds and things like that? Again, here with the facilities. So the bigger, big sports hall. Oh, it can't fit here. I thought it will definitely fit there. Is, there, is that the bigger? Oh, no, this one will fit. Aha! Here we go. Sports playground over there, that will work. I think this will be a reasonable distance to walk. Uh, we didn't have any pubs, right? Let's do the standard pub. Certainly squeeze something in here. Get a pub there. Probably need a few other pubs around the around and about. We do a pub here. That's good, so we've got two pubs now at least. Anything else, maybe like an art gallery? Yeah, let's do that. Let's squeeze ourselves an art gallery in here. That's it, I like it, I like it a lot. And something culture, well, the art gallery is culture, but we could probably do uh, a library also. See about squeezing a little library over there. There we go, that should work. Help us out a bit. Nice, so that's another block concluded. Okay, now, I'm not gonna start with any others. I think that gives us a, a lot to work on. There's not, not a, lo a lot of residential, so I'll definitely need to fill out a ton more residential over here to be able to use this. This station, I am worried, is not gonna see a lot, uh, except apart from this massive one over here, and these guys will connect there, these guys will connect there too, and there's room for expansion on the outsides also. Okay, heating. Heating is one of our key um, elements, so we'll definitely need to place a few heating plants. So if we're going to, okay, let's see what we're gonna do here. So if we're saying we would like um, truck aggregate loading facility, so at least one loader on this side. And one loader on the other side. Let's move it, turn it around a little bit so we can actually make it work. Okay, so something like that. Now, if we're going to run, we could run a, a battery of heating plants over here. And I think that's a good idea, considering how we've been struggling with uh, the appropriate amount of heating plants all along. Now, if we flip this over, my question is, do we run it? No, we probably need...
probably need to do a little something like this. Just move it a fair bit away. Yeah, I think this is going to be about the right. And then we'll we'll run a, a battery of them over here. If we switch on the contours, ooh, this wouldn't work because we don't have an excavator in the area. So if I go and switch that uh, on the paying with rubles on, we should be able to get that out. Okay, now if we switch that off again. One. Two. And if we flip that around, we'll do, yeah, excellent. Do the other direction now. Get them a little closer together. Two, and we'll move it a little bit further away. And there we go. So we'll do like four heating plants on that side. That'll require a bit of a bus station on the one side also. So let's get... Um, let's just go with the standard conveyors. Apart from the fact that we won't be able to get a road connection going. So if we just do the this one. Uh, no, that doesn't have... Is that? That should have a road connection. How come? How come it doesn't want to work? Can we not get this? Ah, oh, there we go. I believe that should be workable. If we do the one there. there and one there it means all of these guys should quite comfortably get their uh, their coal collection from here excellent look at that that's brilliant now let's commission those pieces let's get a bit of a road going on in this area so if i'm saying okay this is the most important connection so we want to get stuff connected yeah Okay, so let's actually run it up there and now we'll try and tie all of these in so that we can get some firefighters to the mix here. Okay, and then from here, let's actually get it off, off here. Let's switch off snapping F4 so we can get the little short section through there. We tie it in like so. We make sure that we can get firefighters over there. There we go. That's our connection to heating. Um, what I'd also like us to do is make sure that we have connection to the other side. So we'll go ahead and connect that there. And I'm kind of tempted to put a bit of a bus station in here. So actually, maybe let's trim this one back a little bit and we'll straighten it out. Something from there, maybe. Yeah, there we go. That makes a lot of sense. So now we've got this going for us. Let's uh, get those connected. We can now put some stuff like technical services and things in here. So let's get a huge amount of technical services going. 11 vehicles. That's probably a good, good enough for us. Ooh, this is going to be a good spot for it. I think this will work. Yes, there we go. Nice little technical services spot over there. Should be quite helpful. 
Um, do we need? Yeah, let's get a, a fuel station going. We'll uh, we'll just go with one of these, maybe. Okay, so now we've got a fuel station in there as well. Okay, so now the heating should um, should work. Um, I wanted a bus station, so let's grab ourselves something like this. Okay, modded uh, station platform. Uh, if we have a look at that. Platform station. Okay, I want an in and out um, station. So it's just the small one though. The medium does not have an in on the one and an out on the other side. We still don't have proper bus stations that I really like. So we'll get this small one. The small one should do the trick. If we do that, okay, and we'll get, uh, just, uh, ooh, 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 that's not the button. Get me my road. Okay, so a little bit of this. Do that, get that connected. So now we've got a bus station over here that would um, allow uh, workers to pop over here to the heating. Let's quickly do our heating pipes a few different locations we're going to go with, with the underground variety okay so from this first one it's interesting those aren't allowing access to the to the underground that's really interesting but we're only really after two let's go underground so we can see how that's going to work um i believe we should be able to get it to some infrastructure in the way. Can we... If we go up to about there... Oh, beautiful. I think that's just about reaching it. Let's just go with a direct connection through there. Let's grab the next one. And we'll... If we go... Something like that. That gives us uh, gives us uh, heating in this area, and from the second one we can run. Uh, not quite what I was after, right? Do that again. I will get that to work. Let's see if we can get... We don't have snapping. Can we get snapping to work here? Should be able to. There we go. Snapping. Nice. Get you over there. And then from there, we'll just go and... Are you in like so? Oh, that's awesome. So now that's heating to that side. And that gives us a bit of spare capacity. I'm, I'm wondering, I don't think we're going to make it all the way down here. But let's, uh, let's give it a shot here. Let's get our... We're all heading. Aha, down this way. I'd rather we try and do it pretty direct. There we go, that's quite useful. Don't do that. There we go, that's pretty good. That's looking good. So now our heating should work really well. 
Uh, now, this is going to be the question. Will these guys reach? I think that one has got uh, not a great shot. That's about a kilometer. Maybe we can do a pump forwarding station somewhere over here. But let's just see how that works. So if we go one there, too long. It's exactly what I thought. So we'll, we'll need to do a pump forwarding station for that one. Can we get this one to work? Oh, it's really close. It's really close. Let's, uh, let's give it another shot. It's so close. So we needed straight lining. Oh, it's so close. It's so close. It's really so close. Yeah, I don't, I could, yeah, but if I move it, it's going to be a bit of an issue. So let's, um, let's just cancel all of this. And what we'll do is we'll do a pump forwarding station here somewhere. And we'll run both of them into it. And then we'll go from there. So a heat uh, pumping station. We'll, uh, we'll place it next to the infrastructure over here. It's, it's kind of out of the way. We'll give it its road connection. Okay, so with that in place, we should be able to do this. We should be able to then run back. Come on. How come? That's uh, quite ironic that it doesn't want to run through there while the other one did. Okay, so we'll do something like this. We'll get those guys in there. It's not the tidiest connection. We make sure we go underneath the infrastructure here. Underneath that infrastructure and uh, that's not connected. Bring it back. Try that one more time. That'll work. From here, we'll get that connection. And get that to work. So that pumping station is not ideal, but since we only got the two connections, hopefully it'll be okay. Now, that's okay, all good. We will, I'm gonna, <laughs> I think I'm gonna, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and pay for that. It's quite a pricey little 171 million rubles to build all of those guys. Okay, that's good. Okay, now, getting out of there, that's all good. Uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to sign some construction and we're going to get this party started. Um, it's been a, quite a substantial, but look at this. Look at this amazing layout that we've got going on over here. So hopefully the heating is all good. What we'll need to do next is look at where the power is going to come from. But let's firstly assign some construction. So helicopters one. So let's do... Uh, what, which one is this? I see six. So let's get... How come you can't assign here? That's not... Helicopter? Ah, maybe it was just okay. Let's uh, let's get those two assigned. Let's get these two assigned. Is that one too far away? Nah. Get uh, something like that. Technical services, though. We will need. Which is the first area that we're going to do? Are we going to do this one first? So we'll do these little areas over here, and I'm going to build the infrastructure myself. 
So let's go assign that one there and there. Get the hospital going. Get these things going. So let's get this area up and running first. Probably need to assign some more of these guys. Oh, we definitely want to get some of those things built. Okay, now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to make sure that we actually get these little road sections done. Okay, road sections done. Okay, there's a lot that needs to be built here. And I've got a little bit more road connections over here. Okay, and these sections and those sections and those sections. There we go. Excellent. That's most of our roads now sorted out. Uh, apart from these, let's get this sorted out. Ah, there's one more. There's a few. There's so much that we still need to do, actually. Just want to get all of these little road sections done. That's going to just uh, be uh, painful to get done. I haven't seen any helicopters here yet. <laughs> Which um, means that it's quite a distance for the guys to, to make their way over here. And we're not playing at a top speed or anything like that. So there we go. That's pretty good. Uh, this little section still needs some roads. Okay, awesome. Okay, one thing that I did miss out on was storage for oil and things like that. So if I go with rail, the rail oil unloading piece, right? Dry bulk oil, oil loading and unloading. We could do something like this and try and get it to, to work. We should be able to make that to work. So let's flip it around. So we'll make it go to the other side. Let's get it in something like this, right? That should be okay. Now, can we, in fact, Get that to go off of where? Shall we just do it off here? Yeah, I think that's about the right. I'm hearing helicopters. Uh, get my snapping sorted. Really? Yeah, so maybe we're going to do even one more. Ooh, there's no more room. So how are we going to make that work? I am hearing the helicopters doing their thing. Do we need the two, though? Let's see if we can make this one work on this side. Yeah, uh, we should be able to. Just need a little bit more room there. Get that one to exit. Come on. Maybe that's not going to work. Uh, maybe that, if that's the case, we... Is that the save? Yeah, auto save. But it's lagging. Want to see the helicopters in action in just a jiffy? Why am I getting issues here? Trying this again. Can we at some point make this work? Does not want to. Does not want to. Okay, maybe that's all that it is then. Then we're not going to run the second rail line through there. And that's all that it's going to be. It's just going to have the one. Yeah, 
if you bear in mind that that's not a lot of space. I'm going to try and move it a little bit. So let's uh, demolish this guy. Uh, and we're going to remove the little rail connections. Cancel those. Let's try that one more time. So these, then we want the oil loading, unlo unloading. Gonna flip it around. I think that's about as good as it's gonna get. If we do that, can we get this connected? Come on, come on. Even the other one? Nah, now it's too close. Okay, so alternatively, what we could do is we could we could try and run something out of this. Okay, let's do that as a starting point and we'll move this one back a little bit. So now that should give us a bit more indication. Okay, so let's uh, grab our oil loading, unloading station. I'm gonna flip it around yet again. But if we do, I believe if I do it here, it should work. So let's try that. Please work. Yes, there we go. That is going to work. Now the question is, will this work? Okay, so let's get that straight out of there. Get it a little bit like this, and then we'll try and smooth it out that way. Hopefully that is sufficient. So now we're actually using one of them. We won't be able to do both. Clearly not, unless we are going to do something like that. Interesting. Okay. Anyway, that's not a, uh, that's not the purpose of it. So there we go. That will be all connected as also. And now we just need some. I'm thinking both um, bitumen and so we want some storage. So go to storage for oils. Um, I'm going to do kind of kind of. Let's do. The small one for bitumen and the large one, uh, large one for fuel. Okay, so if I switch on the rubles, are we going to be able to make this work? Oh. To make that more pronounced is also this um this this trench that we've got there the one there we don't need to connect these together and one let's get the smaller one we don't need that much bitumen around get the smaller one going also oh actually we could provide a loading facility for vehicles here Let's do that. Okay, let's get our pipes connected. Oil refineries. Okay, let's get our pipes. Liquid. Liquids. Now, do we do the above ground option here? I'm kind of tempted to do the above ground option. Because this will... If I go switch that on... No, the above ground option is never going to work here. Uh, actually... If we do something like that... That's okay, and what we'll do is, so that's the, the above ground option, and then what we'll do is we'll do an underground one for the other side. Let's just uh, go underground so we can see. Okay, build our pipes. 
Here we go, nice. Nice, switch off this. We should get some road connections in here. There's a fair bit of road connecting that needs to happen still. Can we potentially get a crossing here? Be really good if we could get another crossing. Anything want to work in terms of a crossing? I didn't think it would. This one maybe? Far away, close by, just the one. Nah, then he went through there, it's going to be a problem. Just a direct connection through this side. But at the very least, we need a bit of a connection like so. Where these can tie in. And we get them as close as possible. So that's a bit of a... Okay, so we've got um, two here. One that's going to have construction materials. The other one... Okay, and what do we want? I would wouldn't mind some of these um, some of these roads, cargo stations. But I'm not sure it'll actually work. If we flip it around, though... Yeah, that, that could work quite nicely. Not opposed to that... And we swip, swap, swap it around again. Something like so. Excellent. I like it. I like it. This is getting shape. Taking shape. And that's connected. This one needs to be connected over here. And not space for it. And let's get our road connection all sorted out. So get you connected up there. You'll connect through there. You'll connect onto there. Okay, now what I am looking for is a, a oil loading and unloading facility, which will uh, go in right there. Thank you very much. That'll work. So now we can get our fuel collected right over there. Let's get our road connection going on. Oh, I do need a little bit more storage. So let's get uh, some storage. Something is burning. Um, what kind of storage am I after? I am after, hang on. Let's go modded storage. So I'm after something like the, I think it's just something like this, right? Is that the size that I've got? Yeah, that's the size. So what I'm after in this one. So one is actually looking at foods and things, right? Construction materials. I don't have anything collecting meat. I don't have a meat storage. I don't have a meat storage. So I've got one of these then. That one has food and clothing and electronics and it can have chemicals and it can have, it can have a little bit of everything. So the only thing that I'm then really missing is meat, but I am worried that it might not hold enough. So what I'll do is let's do one more of them and then we'll do a meat, a meat also. So if we can, let's flip it around so we'll and make use of that that should give us a little bit of room in here we'll have one more in there and then is there there would be a nice big meat one for us somewhere there we go a meat storage If I flip it around, actually, if we flip it around, that's going to be way better. I think that'll work. So let's do that. 
Now let's get the, uh, just get that connection sorted out. This connection should work. Oh, crap. And that one? Okay, that one's gonna work. That's okay. I need to pay for that. Get my road connection on. Can I trim this one back just a little? I can. Here we go. Uh, oh, that's the uh, that's the road cargo station. Let's uh, let's get this connection going on first. That'll work. Even that'll work. I like it. All of that is good. Now let's just tie this one in. Nice. There we go. That is our storage facilities. Print plenty of them. We need a few more connections. Let's uh, go and pay for these roads. Now, we may run into trouble with this and may end up connecting through here somehow at, in the future, at a future date, because I'm not sure this is gonna really last, but I think it's a good starting point. This is gonna connect, we're gonna get our fuels and things. This is on the other side, that's gonna work. Uh, these needs to be connected. Ah, the helicopters are bringing in stuff, though it is pretty slow going. I haven't seen crazy amounts of, uh, of action just yet. Now that's good. Uh, we will need to provide a road connection for this guy. And then the question is, do we need anything else in here? But I don't think so. Okay, so there we go. That's basically our connectivity. Kind of wonder if I can make it a little better. So if we do that, just redo that thing all together. Yeah, it's gonna work much better if we do it this way. There we go, that's awesome. That connection is fine. So now I've got all of those connected. And still do some more technical services and things in here. Probably we need some distribution offices um, plenty of them actually. So let's get a distribution office going. Should be under storage. Do we have distribution? No, that's not where it's at. So is it under roads then? For citizens? For cargo? Depots? Maintenance? Certainly we need some more of this. Can never figure out what we're doing with regards to distribution. Uh, it's probably over here at the cargo. Yeah, here we go, distribution. Shall we do a big one? Well, let's just do the mediums. I think the mediums is probably most appropriate. So yes, that's a pretty good spot for a distribution office right there. That'll work, I like it. Shall we do technical services somewhere over here as well? Happy that it's not in the same spot though. Just do the, the medium sized one. Oh, looks really good. Can we, can we get it to work? Excellent. This is going to look so good. And I actually want to you know what I want to do. Pay for that. I do wonder if we're going to get all of this built on whether we're going to start paying for stuff. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a, I can, I can be quite a, it's a little section of the road that we want to build. I can be quite impatient with this and this is going to take a massive amount of time to get done. We probably need some of these rail things to be worked out as well. Excellent. That's very good. What I wanted to do is provide, um, fences, fences, give me a fence. So. Fence-wise, I thought to run a fence on the other side of this guy so that our cargo facilities is kind of fenced off. Right? I think that's quite going to be quite sensible. So let's 
try and get it as close as possible to that. Yeah, I like that. So we'll do a little fence through there. Then what we'll do is we will provide a fenced section like this. And then we'll run a fence up here. And now I don't think we're going to have a proper gate. So we'll have to see about how we deal with that. Fence up there. Fence up there. Oh, can it squeeze through? I would so like it to squeeze through there. Can it squeeze through? Come on, you gotta. Where can we get? Okay. Now, fence through here. Crap, the infrastructure's in the way. I'm gonna I'm gonna give it one more shot. Let's let's get that thing back a little bit. Can we potentially squeeze a little section of of it through there? It's so close. Literally needs a bit of a about a meter on this side. That'll work. Will that work? Oh, that's gonna be that's gonna bother me. We'll uh, go fence up to about there. Can we run a fence underneath this? Come on, we have to. We have to. Where is uh, where is its uh, footings? Really? Oh, it's too close. Okay, well, crappy then. Come on, we had something work over here. Excellent. Ooh. Now that's going to work. Well, what we'll do is we'll just kind of run it up to about there. And then we'll start it again. Actually, we should redo this. Hang on. I'm going to redo this one. Just over there. Now let's just bring it up. Okay. There we go. That'll work. Uh, what's going on? Ah, oh, there we go. Up to about there. And then from this side, we're just going to kind of run it in like that. Come on. Excellent. So there we go. That is our walled off section. It's not, uh, it's not super duper awesome, but uh, it'll at least look the part for our kind of central railway yard and distribution of facilities and, and the likes. A lot of helicopters coming in and a progress is not quick enough. So guys, and actually that's the end of the episode. So I think that's the planning for it. Uh, let's uh, pay for those walls that we've built. There we go. And actually let's quickly do a bit of the airplane square components. So I do think that it's gonna look Pretty awesome if we can make it work. You know what? And I think let's uh, let's actually run it like this. Turned it a little bit. So from the center of that point, it's actually going to run out. Turn it back. I think that's the end of this episode. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll, I'll, I'll get a little bit of this built um, and we won't necessarily um, put the people in here, the citizens in here just yet. If I do that, will I be able to get it to go? Yeah, I think that's about, yeah, yeah, that's actually, that's really good. Um, up to about 
ver I have to turn this a little bit let's turn it a bit too much we turned it too much that okay uh, yeah that's going to be just about right let's run it to the the other side there we go I do want us to see about tying that in and actually this is not going to work we will need to get it to go from here Oof. still not quite what we're after there we go that's that's not a bad one get that all sorted let's see about squeezing this in that nice i like that now finishing that off excellent and if we do the same thing from over here nice there we go look at that that's our rail yard center of the of the of the spot of the place and let's do one little check there yeah there we go I, I do like that that nice solid median over there we'll have to see how we do with all of our um uh, pedestrian connections i think pedestrian connections is going to be the next big thing again if you would like to name this please leave it in the comments our super blocks are looking pretty good okay guys uh, i will see you in the next one and we should have a fair bit more built by that time and we'll start uh, moving in some citizens thank you so much for watching if you've liked it hit that button bye bye